you have a mean value theorem do you know centered formula what is centered formula x bar equal to integral of x da upon integral da is same as x1 a1 plus x2 a2 upon a1 plus a2 or we have total x so we have x bar into a1 plus a2 is same as x1 a1 plus x2 into a2 mean value theorem we don't know what is cheap and we don't know anything eh? we have to just find out what is the mean value is in what proportion sugar at 3.25 kg mix with sugar at rupees 3.80 per kg so that the mixture will be worth for rupees 3.5 kg so we have x1 x1 means price eh? what is price 3.25 a1 means quantity is it 1 kg for 1 kg you are charging 3.25 x2 3.8 what is a2 is also 1 kg if you mix them you will get total a will be 2 kg and so that the mixture will be worth of rupees 3.5 so we want x bar equal to what 3.5 now we don't know a1 we don't know a2 we want this quantity actually this quantity and this quantity we want ratio so is this quantity will be a1 plus a2 so what is x bar x bar is 3.5 is it a1 plus a2 is it 3.25 a1 plus 3.8 times a2 can you separate variable you can separate the variable and you can find out what is a1 by a2 so a1 a2 kitna jayega a2 yahan pe 3.8 hai minus 3.5 divided by a1 will be 3.5 minus 3.25 so required ratio is 6 by 5 okay don't waste your idea that what is cheap and what is in what ratio the wheat must be mixed at this will be mixed with this and this one mixture price is what this value x1 3.2 this quantity is a1 x2 what price 2.90 a2 what is the mean price 3.08 so what is x bar x bar is x bar into a1 plus a2 a same as x1 a1 plus x2 a2 x bar 3.08 a1 plus a2 a simply 3.2 a1 plus 2.9 a2 you can separate variable and you can get a1 by a2 3 by this answer was 3 by 2 16 liter of soda is mixed with 5 liter of wine and what is the price of soda 12 and what is the price of wine 33 bar tender wants How much profit? Twenty-five percent profit on his investment. What price should he sell this mixture? We have soda with a price of what? Twelve. Soda is price twelve. And what is the A1 quantity? Soda is mix is sixteen liters. So we have wine. What is the price of wine? Thirty-three. And how much he is going to make? Five liters. First of all, can you calculate mean of this? So mean of this quantity is A1 X1 plus A2 X2. Divided by a1 plus a2, 17. So remember, this is the mean price and this is his cost price. Now he want to make a profit of what? 25 percent. So selling price must be 25 percent higher than the cost price. So it is 1.25 of this, 17 into 1.25, 21.25. That much selling price he should do. A merchant has a 1,000 kg of sugar, part of which he sells at 8 percent profit. And rest at 18 percent profit. He gains 14 percent on the whole. The quantity sold at 18 percent profit is you have to find out. One is 8 and one is 18. You want to know is this quantity? So we have two sugars now. So we have sugar one. That is quality one. How much profit? 8 percent. 8 percent no. And let's say he sold a one quantity of this sugar. Then what is second sugar? How much profit he want on second sugar? He want 18 percent. And let's say he has sold a two quantity of this, and he gains fourteen percent whole. Is it x bar? That is the mean profit. Mean profit is how much? Fourteen percent. And he has given total quantity of a one plus a two equal to one thousand. So we have x bar a one x one plus a two x two upon a one plus a two is a. This bar is fourteen. In which you are interested? A two is interested. So we will replace a one as one thousand. Minus a two, x one is eight. 
a2 x2 is 18 divided by 1000 so you can very well solve for a2 quantity 600 so quantity sold at 18 percent profit was 600 naturally remaining is what 400 kg the cost of type 1 rice is rupees 15 per kg and the type 2 rice is 20 kg per kg both type 1 2 are mixed in the ratio then the price per kg of the mixed variety you have to find out so this time we have rice 1 the what is the price of rice 1 is 15 corresponding quantity is a1 type 2 the price is 20 a2 and he has also given the ratio a1 by a2 2 by 3 so we have x bar equals to a1 x1 plus a2 x2 divided by a1 plus a2 x bar we don't know we will substitute all values in terms of a1 so we have a1 x1 is 15 can we write a2 3 by 2 multiplied by x2 20 and whole thing divided by again a1 this is multiplied by a1 huh? this is a1 plus 3 by 2 of a1 a1 is get cancelled and you can get the mean price as 18 a milk vendor has two cans of milk first can contains 75 percent of water and the rest is milk second contains 50 percent of water naturally 50 percent of milk how much milk should be mixed how much milk should be mixed from each of the containers so as to get 12, 12 liters of milk such that the ratio of water to milk is 3 is to 5 so we have can 1 how much water 25 percent is water how much percent of milk naturally 75 percent is milk so what is the ratio of them is it 1 is to 3 1 is to 3 ratio what is the concentration of milk in this that we called as x1 is it 3 by 4 this one is a water and this one is milk huh? so this concentration is what 3 by 4 and let's say a1 is the corresponding quantity now what is can 2 what what is water 50 percent milk is 50 percent so what is the ratio 1 is to 1 what is the concentration of milk x2 why do i tell because i think we are knowing the quantity of milk here 12 liters of milk is it 1 by 2 let's say this quantity is a2 how much total quantity is a1 plus a2 is 12 12 liters a1 plus a2 is 12 and what ratio a1 x1 plus a2 x2 upon a1 plus a2 Amara ratio kitna hai final wala mixture wala this is mixture ratio it is 3 is to 5 it means that concentration of milk in average x bar 5 by 8 so i think it is sufficient now 5 by 8 a1 x1 is 3 by 4 a2 we can replace as 12 minus a1 into 1 by 2 and in denominator we can write 12 so we can get a1 first if a1 is 6 liter naturally b is also 6 liters 75 liter mixture of wine and water contains 80 percent wine how much water should be added to decrease the concentration of wine so we can solve this problem by law of conservation of mass but in different way so we write this summation of concentration of wine multiplied by volume equal to the final concentration multiplied by total volume is the same formula actually mean value theorem here but we put up in different form so what is the first one 75 liters of what mixture of wine and water contains 80 percent of wine it means that we are only talking about the wine now so we have 75 multiplied by 0.8 and there is no water here on this side we have final concentration equal to what 0.75 and what volume we want the original volume is 75 plus certain quantity x i have not considered the water percentage here if i take water x then what is the percentage of concentration of wine zero this one is what total mixture of what mixture how much it contains uh, wine pointed only we are only interested in what wine percentage so if you add water then what is the percentage of uh, wine zero so this is x is it total volume so what is the value of x so you have to add extra five liters of water so that its concentration will decrease from 80 percent to 75 percent so in that case you can use the formula as reduced concentration equals to 
initial concentration into bracket 1 minus amount replace each time divided by total volume or total amount and this you have to make as a power equals to n that is n number of times. So normally they give certain quantity of full of data all then one third part of it is taken out then equal amount of water amount is poured into the bottle to fill it. This operation is done how much time? 4 times. Then find the final ratio of water to data all. Equal amount of water no? It should be water. Chale, so kya wala option check karke? Every time how much is a full of bottle first? Bottle is full of data all. One third of it is taken out and it is re then re replaced by water and again the bottle is full. This operation is done how many times? 4 times. Find the ratio of Det all to water in the bottle. So we have this concentration. So we have reduced concentration equals to initial concentration is 100 percent. Initially the bottle is full of det all 100 percent. 1 minus how much amount is replaced? Is it one third of the total quantity equal to 1? How much time this experiment is done? 4 times. This number come out to be 0 0.1975. This is a reduced concentration of what? Det all. So can we find out concentration of water? is 1 minus 1 minus 0 0.1975 0 0.8025 what do you want you want the ratio of detol to water so 0 0.1975 divided by this value so ratio of detol to water is same as detol is 1975 divided by 0 0.8025 1 by 4 25 percent 